So you might be in a situation where your notifications are missing on your Android phone. Now what does this mean? Well basically you might be seeing that no notifications are basically coming through to your phone or it looks like you were supposed to get notifications but none of them are actually functioning. Now the first thing and the main reason why this ends up happening is usually because you may have some sort of do not disturb mode on. So what I'd recommend doing here is just going through and making sure do not disturb mode is not actually on because if it is that's basically going to be the main problem that you have here. So what I'd recommend doing is for the most part, going through and clicking on do not disturb mode or holding it down and making sure do not disturb mode isn't on. Or if it is on, making sure that specific notifications can still go through, like it says display option for you know hidden notifications, just go through and you can still you know see these notifications and have them built up. And that's the main thing you can do here too. Now, another thing you can try doing is basically going through and making sure your notification settings aren't actually messed up within these specific you know, set settings of your phone. So what you can do is you can go into your settings application right inside of your phone. You wanna go and find the notification panel. So go and find notifications. And right under app settings, you just wanna make sure all the notifications that have the capability of sending notifications are there. So go and scroll through, find these specific notifications, and also make sure that within those specific apps that you're trying to you know, get notified from, Snapchat, Instagram, messages, whatever, making sure that your notifications are enabled there too. Now, if that's still not working, you may just wanna go ahead and try going into your settings application of your Android phone, scrolling down into system, clicking on system update, and all you're gonna to wanna to do is update your specific Android phone if you're having issues here too. So that's another thing that can probably give you some issues, and if that can probably fix it, if there's no update, try restarting your phone, and that might end up fixing the problem too for you. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.